I, I don't... I just finished. I just left. We had an idea. We used it with no viewers. We did this earlier, too, with Afro Ninja. We just made a brain. Whoa. And then shoved that in the head. But you can just make stuff. You can just you can just see what happens. There just there's no accident. Whoa, hold up. Whoa, I know like the frames are probably looking weird because they're looking weird to me. Like it's having trouble keeping up with this level of brush spam. But hold on, this dude's head is about to look like straight up ramen. Bro, look at how cool this dude's hair is. He's so trendy. How do you do that? Look at his makeup. This guy, he is living life. This is like Justin Timberlake. Straight up ramen hair. Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. Should we get a body? They, they think they have stamped bodies. Like, we can see what we can do with just stamps. <laughs> Since I did all kinds of, all my non-stamp stuff earlier. Oh, yeah. Oh, let's give him a lady body, body with food. Oh, that's as big as it gets? That is a problem for me. That is not big enough. What is that? What am I supposed to do? Let's grab our layer. Oh, no. First of all, the fact that the hair and the brain are on the same layer. What? <laughs> That's great. That's absolutely rich. 100% chance of stealing your girl with makeup like this too. I mean, I feel like the blue stuff on his face is really a selling point. If we were to just, you know. Hmm, hmm, maybe like a little. 100% steal your girl. I feel like that just ruined it. Alright. Anyway, back to the layer. We're going to go to both layers simultaneously and shrink this whole thing down. But that didn't really help us, did it? Because we're still going to be stuck with the tiniest body of all time. That's the problem that we have, is the teeny tiny body that's not going to get any bigger. What am I supposed to do? <laughs> that's a pretty good body, bro. You got it now. Uh, yeah, that's the good stuff. And that's max size. How did I make this head so big? What did I do? I feel like it was a different scale before. <laughs> well, that's the other leg. Yeah, we're good. We'll just toss this one. Yeah, other foot. That's good. Oh, that makes you look muscly, bro. You got them leg muscles. And it's just three tiny people to hold up the, the weight of this one giant dude. We go back to the other foot. That is art. Wow. You guys even see art like that? No. I bet not. I bet you never see beautiful art like this. Tribod? Hell yeah. What? You know what? Why three, man? Because we got this weird mutant human centipede one right here. Look at that. That's some sort of uh, weirdness. The tracking issue got sorted. I remember a lady face was on the stream with me one day and we couldn't get in the corner and like all kinds of uh, like little problems and like controller jumps would pop up. And now it doesn't do that. Like bro, I mean, it's that camera right there. That was the difference. And my mic isn't on my wrist, so you guys can probably barely hear me when I'm talking. My hero's hands are rubbed up. The human centipede? Dude, that's a selling point. Like, hold on now. I know you're not trying to act like, let's do, let's toss a dude's body over here. Oh, look at them pecs. 
I know what the good stuff is. What leg is this? I'll go with this one. <laughs> this one's can candy with a big ass. Oh my god. That one's got an ass. Hold on. Yeah, like that. I work with the hands. The hands are, the hands are really selling it for me. Like for real, the hands, the arms. What if we just smooth out this neck a little bit? Hold on. Let's smooth this bad boy out. So. Do I have the wrong, do I have both layers selected? Yeah, we, we can work with either layer here. I like the layer without the head though. Because that tells a whole nother story. This is like the king brain uh, flying over the headless, armless zombie people. Wow, arm bros, chill. That is that is beyond caricature of a dude. That is my statement on the on the on humanity check. I feel like this is the future of humanity. Look at this look at this gummy brain sack in here. Because you gotta know. What if we take the brain? Oh my gosh. I'm a fucking genius. Hold up. Let's just, let's just, let me just see the brain layer, please. Okay. We're gonna duplicate the brain layer. One time. Great, now if we turn off this layer, we still have another brain layer. Excellent, excellent. We're gonna go to layer three. I'm going to get a shape. That's great. And we're on layer three. We're 100% sure that we're on layer three, and it's the only layer we can see. And we're going to delete. Oh, I said delete. The bodies. And our shiny hair we made. Because this is a duplicate layer. And we're not confirmed. Shrinking this down and getting a little bit more. Room. The brain looks like intestines. Well, the brain started out as like a piece of just like bubble gum, and then Afro Ninja was bouncing between this stream and another one, and came up with what we got here. So now. That's just beautiful. We're going to turn this layer off and go back to our other layer. And we're just going to take the brain out. I'm sure you guys figured out where we were going with this. Okay, we are clearly on the wrong layer somehow. Yep, we just f the shit out of this brain. Okay, we fixed it. Cool. Let's not make the same mistake. Let's go to this layer. Get rid of this layer. And now delete the brain. I like that the paint goes deep into the sculpture. That's a cool. Whoa, I just smashed my face through something. Very uncomfortable. 
It's not a horror show. It's a beautiful lady's house. My house. I'm a beautiful lady. And don't you forget it. All right. Great. Now, when we turn all of our layers back on, we have everything back, but this is where it's going to get good. We're going to go to layer three, and we're going to switch it to an emissive material that can just glow. Oh, yeah, just a glowing, pulsating human brain of happiness. Look at that. Or what if we just made it metal? Hold on. Let's go with metal. Look at that. Now it looks like he's got a, an artificial brain. Boom! More statements about society. Artificial brain, many body, two armed little bitch with Justin Timberlake ramen hair. Oh, you got a glowy ass head. Look at you. So shiny. So metal. <laughs> For sure. Shiny and metal, man. And what if we take like the, the see? And we can just take the layers like that and like manipulate them, so we can like make this whole guy metal if we wanted to. And then it's like, whoa, that was face is metal. But at the same time, I don't think we're too metal. We can uh, we can make them a little bit. Let's make them a little bit more shiny. I like them shiny. Oh, now it looks almost like porcelain. Oh, so smooth. Like, you know what? It's so smooth. I'm just going to hit him with a little bit of smooth and smooth up his ear. What? Right. He's really smooth, though. Smooth out his neck area into his bodies. Let me get rid of his back neck. It's a bit scary. Ravenbones now following you on Twitch. All right, so now we have a little portion. Oh, look at all the butts. Hold on, now when we turn it upside down and we just have an army of butts, I feel like we should fill them all with dicks. I feel like we should dick butt every one of these. But look at all these butts. Oh man. Wow, so many butts. I feel like Tina right now. And so, what if we porcelain? We should porcelain the whole. So what? What did we do here? What did we? We went point seven three one one point five two. Okay. Let's switch to the uh, the other layer here. And, oh, point seven three ish one one point five four. Close enough. So now the whole guy is porcelain. Oh yeah. Look at those porcelain butts. Did you guys ever know how beautiful? Hold on. I want to freeze this. Look at it. All right. Wow, bro. Thanks, man. Is that what I just heard? Wow, bro. Thanks, man. <laughs> Molasses? Molasses? So let's just take a, a gander. I took off my headset, so I can just look at what you guys are looking at. These beautiful porcelain bottoms. How do you, how do you, how do you live life without having this every part of every day from now on? Just knowing that you could have all these butts. I'm not like Ladyface though, I don't have a cool saying. I do have some cool news, I've dropped 138 frames total over 2 hours and 31 minutes and 57 seconds. And those 138 frames dropped when I was uploading a GIF to teach whoever was in here, because I can't remember now, because I'm an asshole, how to GIF out a video. Okay. Back to the porcelain butts. So we've got all our porcelain butts here. I feel like, what? how can we complete this statement of society today? Definitely a sillier note. But let's, let's can, can I find like a blondish paint? I really feel like if I could get like Justin Timberlake blonde and blonde. Oh, oh. That is a heck. All right, I'm gonna turn off the spray brush. I'm just gonna go with the brush here. 
so I don't accidentally spray somewhere else. Do I make this harder? Yeah, we'll mark this. This is modern art and it's beautiful. Thank you. I appreciate you appreciating my my Let's just frost the tips. Oh my god. You guys, what if we just frost the fucking tips? Oh my god. How could you guys not be excited at the concept of frosted tips? Oh, we're gonna frost these tips so hard. Oh my god, we're doing it. All these tips, look at them. Oh, they are so frosted. Oh, oh. Except for his hair is white, so really the tips aren't as frosted as his hair is. A little dab in here, a little bit more color. Oh my god, dude, this dude. He's got frosted tips. I, I keep gesturing to the. I'm looking at my camera to show you a giant floating object in my room when I take off my headset. I said, Mo, I said this hair is frosted. God, kids these days. I already corrected it, man. Did it. Alright, so, I mean, we've got this pretty pink lipstick, too. I mean, let's grab that color. Really fill this out. That's lovely. That's lovely. Okay, so we have an artificial metal brain, and we have weird angler hair, and a blue spray painted face because I was gonna do eyes, but I couldn't get the brush small enough because of this. But now everything is too small, so apparently if you save it, the scale changes. So if I shrink this thing down real small and then like save it like this, do I get to put giant bodies on it afterwards? I should reprint this. I mean. <laughs> this is the same guy. This is the same guy. Yeah, I mean, VR, I have a way to bring chat into VR, and I do it sometimes, but it's better. Okay, good. Good freeze part right there. Just for a second, so we can take a look at this. Um. All right, yeah. So the guy who 3D printed kitty feet, I sent this to a printer, which you guys see rolling over here in the corners. I'll stretch them out briefly to uh, to to go over what we're talking about. So we got this is the 3D print, and I just moved Twitch alerts again. I wish I would stop doing that. Yeah, cool. And this is a uh, the sculpting moment. This is very, I'm sure, unsettling to see. Okay. So in the same style, we had this guy over here sculpted, and we printed this, and we had this print on the left side that we're looking at now. And the guy came at me, he's like, dude, this is the weirdest thing I've ever printed. Like, straight up. It's 100% weird. What is wrong with your brain? And I didn't even show him the dick butt. Like, he hasn't even seen the dick butt. But him trying to print what we're looking at right now, these two, if I asked this, if I sent this off to be printed, I think this dude would try to have me committed. He's that kind of guy. It freaks him out to see anything that's not like perfectly chill. Um, yeah. Oh, what, what's not that weird? Kitty feet or this thing? Because this thing's pretty weird, dude. Four bodies and two arms on a neck with Justin Timberlake hair and a metal brain. The kitty feats isn't that weird. Also, hi, birthday sandwich. It is a horror show, I hope. Let's see what else is in here. Yeah. I don't know, man. Just going off and using kitty feats. Yeah, kitty feats isn't weird. I didn't think so. I mean... It looks like a Pokemon, dude. Like, how harmless is that? 
It looks like it's gonna like come save the day. <laughs> this one looks like it was burned in a vat of acid. I would be scared of the one that printed real bad. Maybe. But that's his own fault for printing it bad. What am I supposed to do about that? It's always funny when you don't know where the controller is. Pull a baby face. Yeah, this guy's just another example of what you can do with a, a broken brain and some uh, stamp tools. Look at that. That's real nice. Let me just fire off a separate video. Start recording. Okay. We'll just take a gander here what we're looking at. You guys see the stuff on top and bottom of this, but I don't because my vision is like normal. We got ourselves a pretty little video of a metal brain many body <laughs> tub to I like these legs down here. These are kind of one of my favorite parts. I put one leg in the backest body and one leg in the frontest body just to be like extra weird about it. Hey babe. Yeah. There's actually people watching the stream. Lady face host doesn't. There you go. No problem. Opening peanut butter. Everybody's saying what up. Maybe the hash dash at that time, but probably not. All right, so we're definitely gonna, I mean. Okay, so it's hovering this thing, right? Oh, you can see through it and look at the brain. You look at the layers. That's pretty dope. I like that. Um, oh, yeah, okay. 2017. Ooh, so good. Twenty seventeen society. I'll put that on my thingiverse. People can three D print it. <laughs> what if we just tried to make like a body? This is what the saving icon, or it's it's making this a model for a three D printer. So, there we go. And now I have a 3D printer model. That's as hard as it is. People go, how do you get it to 3D print? Well, you click this button right here, and then it puts this file on your stuff. So there's that. Oh, that's the stream head from earlier that we made, and then we just messed with it more. This is something that Ladyface and I made on stream one day a long time ago. I know they're stamp style thing, but this is a head in the head. What, dude? There's like another person inside this guy trying to escape. What? You see this? What? Yeah, catch him. Yeah. Oh, 308 frames dropped. Wait, is that the same frame drops from before, or have I had? Oh, I had fresh frame drops. And where are the fresh frame drops? related to not bandwidth. Okay, some frame drops, it's okay if it's a frame drop. It comes from, whoa, shit. 